Just hold up, hold up. Good morning, everyone. This is a very beautiful day in Melbourne. The weather now is pretty fucking cold and sunny. I don't know why. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna go grocery shopping, and I'm gonna see you guys in a bit. Hello there. Hi. Um, welcome to my kitchen. Here is my kitchen, and um, let's let's get straight to the point. As my the title of video said, I am going to cook something today. It's a very simple pasta dish. Um, since the dawn of time, well, internet, I must say, people have been doing this um, dish for a long time, lots of times, and now I'll attempt to do that again, maybe in my own way. The most, I mean, in the way that I think it's most traditional. The dish name, I really hope that I pronounce this right, is Ayo, Ayo Olio. So basically, garlic, oil, pasta. Let's get to it. Now for the ingredients, we got parsley, garlic, oh shit, uh, some olive oil, and for me, chili flakes. Also, because it's a pasta dish, we got pasta. And to cook the pasta, we got a pot of water. It's very important that we actually salt the water heavily, big time. Now, with the movie magic, we got our garlic ready to go. And we'll thinly slice them, slowly. Uh, and then halfway through, I'll speed up and then realize that my knives is not sharp enough so I'll just panic slice it up put them in the cup put them in the cup and cut straight to the parsley part now we have a bunch of parsley magically appears on the board what we're gonna do right now is we're gonna pull them up in our palm Use the knife to slice them up and then chop them finely. Now that we've had it finely chopped, put them in a bowl. That's our parsley. And that is our garlic. Ready to rock and roll. Don't forget to clean your board, your knife. And now let's move on to the stove top. As our water is boiling, in goes the pasta. And then, because the olive oil is very healthy, go nuts on it, don't worry. And some garlic, and the last slice of garlic, because nobody's perfect. So you leave it there in peace for it to brown. That was shaky shaky. And we just sprinkle a little bit of chili flakes on there. What I'm doing here is just to put some pasta water to lower the heat. Because you don't want to fry your pasta. That is punishable by eating overcooked pasta for the rest of your life. And that's not very funny. And pasta to the pan. And you flip one, flip two, flip three, flip four. And then now you're gonna put the parsley in like so and then you flip 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 stir stir fuck flip 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 I guess that's good and it's ready to be served put your pan on the board and try to smell it for dramatic effect even though your nasal passage is blocked as hell and a carving fork with a thing and you spinny spin and mac spin a lot. And you drop it there. Mm -hmm. That sounds right. And half that portion again, because you're hungry as hell. On you go. Mm -mm. And then you want to, you know, scoop some slices of garlic with olive oil. 
for it to look shiny and you know good I guess yep and now to the dramatic part chili flakes there it is sprinkle the chili flakes for the billet a little bit of color ah that's good there you go hold up okay now here I have a little bit of parmigiano reggiano and a lemon now people sometimes put it on I don't and please don't do that in front of an Italian grandma just no all right let's go on and taste this thing now the moment of truth well I'm just gonna voice over my um, what do you call it reaction holy shit that's good god damn and in a moment I'll be jumping around let's ignore the fact that I hit my toes in a draw and it's that good thank you for watching please do like and subscribe tell me what you think